Introducing the Single Door Cutout Kit. <laughs> This is a non-telescoping cutout kit. It fits all doors up to a 24 inch wide cutout. It includes two 24 inch steel tubes and four of our one-way couplers to make it fast and easy to install. Let's show how to do it. For this example, we're going to be installing a 17 inch wide by 24 inch high single door. The first step is to go ahead and mark on your frame that 17 inch cutout plus a half inch wiggle room. So for 17 and a half inches, mark on the frame with a, a black marker where you wanna locate this door. Then step two would be to install your right and left vertical tubes identified with yellow paint. These are sold separately. That's why we always recommend to get those extra vertical tubes for 50% off when you're buying the modules to save extra money. Now go ahead and install those first. Now to install a vertical tube, you'll go ahead and install your one-way coupler into the uh, vertical tube. Now, when you're trying to screw in your one-way couplers, you can see here that it's open here and there's a little bit of flex there. So up here, it's more rigid near the solid side. So when you put that in, you should try to aim your screw close up here to the rigid side. If you come down here, you could actually miss the coupler or the coupler could, could possibly bend in and you won't get a good secure uh, hold. So always aim high near the solid and rigid side on these one-way couplers. Now we like to not screw this one in. We can screw this one in now, but keep one side unscrewed to give you a little bit of um, flexibility to, to uh, screw this into your frame. And it's that easy, and then we'll just go ahead and you just screw them right in, just like we have here, giving that cutout width spacing. Very easy. Now that we have our left and right vertical tube installed into our module, we're gonna go ahead and take our 24 inch tubes over to the chop saw and cut them down to 17 and a half inches to fit between these two tubes. So now we've got our tube cut here for the bottom of the door cut out. We'll take our one ways and we'll slip them into the, the tube. And then we'll go ahead and position it in the bottom of the frame. We like to slide it all the way down so that the ears of the one way coupler rest on the bottom of the frame. That keeps it perfectly level and we don't have to do any measuring. We have a perfect bottom now. So we'll go ahead and we'll screw that in, one screw on the top and one here, and then we'll measure up 24 inches plus a half inch wiggle room up the frame and we'll make a mark on both sides. It's that easy to do. And then we'll just go ahead and install the other tube that we cut to fit with 24 and a half inch clearance for our example. We'll take the bottom, the top tube and we have our one way couplers in it and we'll position it so the, the below the tube here is just to that line or slightly just above it so that we'd have the full clearance from underneath here to the top of there 24 and a half inches for our example. Now we like to use these clamps so we can clamp it in. And that's what's great about this one-way couplers. It has a great place for you to clamp this, making it very easy to clamp here and put a screw in there. And we'll clamp both sides just like that. And then we can go ahead and lock this in with our screws. See how easy this is with the tubes and the one-way couplers. This is a much faster and easier system. Now that completes the installation of our single door kit. It is the same in installation for our 36 inch wide uh, double door cutout kit. 
it would just be, we'd just get longer tubes in the kit that you would cut down to fit your double door. But the installation is the same. Thank you for watching this video. We wish you a good outdoor kitchen project.